All right, it's breakfast time. Of course, Max has to be right in there. He can't wait to clean those babies. <laughs> Molly is being a really one. being a really good mom. And Prince <laughs> lost his nipple. <laughs> Lexi's doing good. Lexi, princess. princess. Prince. Hi, Prince. He's so cute. He had the biggest nipple though, so he's fine. Oh. Let's see where little bear is. Molly, let me see little bear. Oh, there's little bear. And little, look, his eyes are open. He opened them. So everybody's eyes are open now. And it's going to be really fun to watch all the babies today, fly. today a lot of people is coming over. So I'm happy that they can all see their pretty eyes. Yeah, we have oh. a lot of kids coming over today. We have two nephews, one niece, my three kids, and a friend with two kids going to stop over, and another kid is getting dropped off because I'm already going to be like nine deep, so I figure at this point, if anybody needs a babysitter, you might as well just drop your kids off. Just kidding. No, don't, 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 don't. I lied. <laughs> just kidding. So the more the merrier, but we will guard the little puppy box to make sure that everybody is being careful and gentle with the babies. And we might even just put him out there. Aww, I love his little face. Oh, Mommy, he's so we, cute. Can we put a blanket down and put him out there so everyone can see him better? Yeah, we can put a blanket down in the living room and then we can all sit around it and let the puppies walk around a little bit. And usually I'll turn the heat up a little bit so it's nice and warm. They're doing a lot better. I noticed that they don't really even sleep near the heat lamp anymore. And they're over two weeks now, so they've gotten so big. Can't even believe it. And Max, he just gets right in there. Like there's no room. He's like, I am the world's best dad. <laughs> Look, there he goes. <laughs> he don't care. But they, they're keeping them very clean, and they're doing a really good job. Keeping the welding box clean, I really only have to change the um, pad like every couple days. Because they just poop in there. If they get a little poop smear, but usually they keep them between the two of them. There's not a lot to do in here yet. Now when we start to put them on their puppy mash, uh -huh. it's going to be a different story. But that's not for a couple weeks. And we're going to wean them onto raw mash because I raw feed my dogs so I'm not raw feed puppies. I'm raw feeding the puppies too because I feel like we've gone through all this time of you know cutting buying meat it. and cutting it up and feeding them good healthy raw food that the last thing I want to do is put the puppies on kibble um, but when the time comes their new families will be able to decide what they want to do however I do believe some people are also interested in raw feeding the new puppies, so that'll she, be good. This she's Madison. already sold. She is. Princess is going to a home with another Portuguese water dog, and she will be raw fed. Yay! So yeah. she will be used to the food that she's getting when she goes home. And she is so cute. Look at those eyes. Aww. And then Prince. We may have somebody with a Portuguese water dog that is going to take him. This weekend. Not going to mention any names. Side. Melissa. Oh, I did mention a name. <clears throat> and then we have Lexi. She's still available. She's cute. She's spunky. She likes, <laughs> she likes to play already. And I noticed that when I come in in the morning, the ones that have their eyes open will get up and they walk over and they want you to pet them and stuff. And then little bear down there. Everyone has their eyes open. He is most likely going to Max's breeder, who gets pick of the litter. Um, should he not go to Max's breeder, if he decides that he wants to wait or for a different color dog or whatever his criteria is, then little bear would be available. But I wouldn't know that until he's eight weeks. So. But I don't think there'll be any problem finding home for Little Bear because I already have somebody that wants him too. So, they're all so cute. Yes, very. I may just change my mind and keep them all. Just <laughs> but kidding. But then we will have... <laughs> I'm not doing that. We can't do that. 
Yeah. We can't. Thank we have, you, Ollie. Don't have too many dogs. Yeah. I keep. I try to tell the kids that as cute as they are when they're little. They get shit. huge and get like him. Yeah, they get huge like these ones, and then we would literally have like six huge dogs, <laughs> and they're like, we don't want six <laughs> huge dogs right now. We like the puppies, so. And then we have to have to train all of them. We'd have to train them all not to pee and poop in the house. Yeah. And we'd have to cut up like tons oh, of tons raw meat. Of raw meat. <laughs> we'd have to have our own farm so we could feed all those dogs. Yeah. <laughs> no, we like the puppies. Look it's her. fun. Look at her. She's adorable. If I could oh, see, because Max good. has to be in the mix. He don't oh, play. Yeah. And Molly's like, help me. <laughs> Molly's milk is... She is so engorged because the puppies are getting so big that she literally leaks milk all over the house. <laughs> but that means they're eating good. And she's got plenty of milk and she eats good, so. I'll probably give the big dogs a bath soon. I want to do it, but Can I help you? it snowed out again, so I feel like it's a waste. I might as well wait until a drier day, but. Get away, Matt. I'll do it. <coughs> No, there they are, the babies. Baby. This is Marlo. I have helpers. I have puppy helpers. So these are the faces behind the scenes. And Marlo, and I have Madison, <laughs> and Michaela's over there watching TV. So maybe we'll get her another time. But oh, can I go in the puppy pen? This is Marlo's puppy that yeah. is already sold. It's yeah, princess. princess. Her eye.